Amanda here. I haven't filmed in a while, in a minute. Okay, I'm gonna bring this a little bit closer. I hate when people can see my arms because they're fat. I know, I'm a little insecure. Okay. See you there? Anyway, um, I bought one of the Grande palettes. It's Go Go Boots. Something like that. I, this, this one here, the purple, got me in this one got me. Then I took it home. And I'm like, they're all shimmers. <laughs> um, this is a palette. Great palette to go with other palettes. The formula, I think, is a little weird. I don't know. I can't put my finger on it. It's a little odd. I do like the quads. But I wish that they had at least a brown matte in here. I think it would make it go together more. And this one here can just be extra one. Um, because it doesn't make any sense. But anyway, I am going to review it. I'm going to do two different looks on two different eyes. I am going to use, pair it up with, um, I don't know. Is this one new or not? Because they put out so many. They're like Colourpop. Makeup Revolution. Um, to me, this gives me Valentine's vibes. Oh, like. Big time, I didn't get it when it came out. It's like, it's not Valentine's. It's, Valentine's is over. But anyway, <laughs> I'm going to be using this one. Because this one has a whole lot of colors in it. So, um, more reviews are coming with this one, of course. I got a few palettes to do, to be honest. Um, I did end up buying a mirror with lights and everything. But it's too bright. And I can't really turn it down. And it doesn't charge. Even though the box that says it charges and it looks like it should charge. And it cost me $200. So I have to take that back to Ulta. So it's just not worth it. Um, so hopefully I can get my money back for that one. I thought for $200 it would be a really good, really good mirror. And it has a thing for your phone which works um, to set your phone on. But anyway, I'm back to basics. Oh well. Okay, I'm going to, with this one, I'm going to use this, I'm going to go with two colors that don't really go together. I'm going to use this purple and use this, like, greenish blue. Okay, I'm going to prime my eye. I hope this light is okay. I tried my best. I even switched everything around. Okay. I hope it's okay. Okay, my hair is a mess, but oh well watching my child and speaking of children um i am pregnant again i went to the doctor and they said we only can see like the sack um we can't really see anything else um but you are pregnant so i don't know i'm really weird i i, I just can sense it with my other one i sensed it i only have one this will be two hopefully yeah yeah, it's like, I can sense it. It's really weird. But hopefully, it's just one. But I'm planning on getting my tubes tied um, after this one. Because I'm probably going to need another C-section. Yeah. Okay, this takes a little bit to show up. The purple. Right here. It takes a little bit. Okay, it's showing up, but it's still very light. Okay. It's kind of sticky, a little bit like a stick, sticky texture. So that's good. It means it's going to stay put. Okay. I don't know. Is this not bright enough? I was going, I'm going for a natural, um, light look. So hopefully you can see it. Let's see. I'm going to swatch it on my hand. Okay. Make sure your light is good. Okay. <sighs> so, hopefully I can get a good mirror. I may have to go to a different store. So, okay. I'm going to start with this brush. This is Morphe. Um. JH52. Okay, I'm going to just get this one here. Try to blend it in a little bit. Yeah. 
and then go with a bigger brush, my favorite one, um, JH45. Cover my brush. Just go in there. They're not too hard to work with, but... I think I need a little bit more light. So I'll be back. I think that's better. Hopefully it's not too much light. Okay. So that was pretty easy. Um, But I think I need to go over this color one more time. So, yeah, much better. Hopefully it's not too much. Okay. Light is very hard to... Uh, oops. I still have that green shade on here. Light is very hard to master when you're trying to film. Yeah. I don't know. That's pretty much my hardest thing to get right. Yeah. Okay. I think this eye is pretty much done. It's very easy. You can achieve it very easily. So. Get that a little. Trying to bake it in a little bit. Okay. Cool. So I think that's pretty good. Let's see. Do I have any fall underneath my eye? Yes, I do. Got that purple all, all over and around. Okay. Okay, I'm going to take my oil. I need to get more of my elf. This is actually glass, too. Uh, I got this at Target, so I went back to Target, and they didn't have it. They had it in, like, in... They didn't have it by itself, but they had it in, like, in a pack with other stuff that I didn't need. So. But... I am, I guess I am happy about being pregnant, but I'm super nervous and scared, to be honest. I'm very scared. I, I, just, I just hope nothing goes wrong and that we're both safe and we make it out. Um, um, my, um, last time I didn't know if I needed a C-section and doctors were forthcoming with information they kind of ignored my questions so it wasn't a good experience like at all and I was very frightened so hopefully this time it goes a lot better I'm seeing a different clinic so hopefully it goes a lot better um the surgeons at the hospital were very very good I think I'll go back to those surgeons. Um, but I, those nurses didn't do me any favors. We just say that. And they almost cost me my child because they they were pretty much being lazy. Um, because uh, my child's heart beat was going down. So, yeah. Not good. So I hope this experience will be a lot better. And we're both safe and healthy. And I hope it goes well. I did have a healthy child. The pregnancy was perfect. Barely any morning sickness. But when it comes time for... My body wouldn't dilate. It, it wouldn't do it. It would not do it. <laughs> just would not do it whatsoever. Okay, think about what I'm gonna do here. Uh, I think I'm gonna use this brown here, maybe. I am wearing brown, so okay. So then I need to take a different brown. Yeah, I don't have a true brown in here. I do have this one. I guess that will work. It's kind of like a caramel brown. Yeah, I think I should use, no, I think I should use this one. Because I think that would work better. This one. 
so. Oh, that's very pigmented. Cool. Very pigmented. Make, yeah, Makeup Revolution. Um, they never have the same formula. Ever. So you never know what to expect from them. <laughs> Their formula is always changing. They don't have a true formula. Which I, I can see it can be annoying for some people. Because it's like every time you buy it from them, it's like buying from a different brand. So you gotta get that halo going. Wait, wait, um, yeah. The pregnancy was perfect, the giving birth part was not. I think I said I say many times to myself if I had like high blood pressure or low blood pressure I'm like one of those people I probably would have died because I was scared and freaked out they got me because they weren't communicating to me with anything which is very unfair but but okay. Uh, I took this one right here. Sorry, this one. And I'm using it for my halo. Yeah, I'm getting a little personal today. <laughs> yeah. But I've been kind of disappointed by the makeup industry. Different subject. A little lighter subject. Um... <laughs> Um, I've been very disappointed by the makeup industry right now. Everyone's painting out pinky nude palettes. Like, with gold. I'm like, that's not springtime. That reminds me of Valentine's palette. That's what, exactly what it reminds me of. <laughs> it's like, the, where's the springtime palettes? Yeah, I do have Lucky Charm, but that one's for, that one was for, um, Thanks Patrick's Day. Because it was looking charm. So. I think I said that right. Very good palette. Very awesome. But I want to see more rainbow palettes. Stop with these pinky nude brown palettes. Seriously. Okay. It goes perfect together. Perfect. There you go. Okay. And they got any down here? Yeah, a little bit here. Okay. Yeah, but um, are you having trouble being like interested in makeup right now? Because it's like everyone's putting out the same thing. I don't know. It feels like everyone's putting out the same thing. And I don't understand. Like, where's the spring palettes? I just don't get it. Uh, I did buy one from ColourPop. Like, a pinky nude. Because it did have a hint of yellow. It was a little bit different. I got that from ColourPop. And I also got the, um, the highlighter. It was very interesting looking. So, yep. And I used someone else's code to get that. A little bit finish off. But anyway, I think I'm going to finish up my look. And we'll be back. Okay, I went for a very simple look. I used tinted moisturizer. Kind of lightly. Because my skin is not really having problems right now. So it looks pretty good. Went with this. I think I'm going to use this this summer. And say hell with it. I think I'm going to. Depends on what my skin does. I may have to switch it up here and there. Um, this is by Wet n Wild Tinted Moisturizer. This is more like a, not really a light coverage. It's a, it's middle coverage, like in the middle. So it does need, I, I said this like two years ago, it does need some more shade range. It really does. Okay. But anyway, I used Ofra for my blush. Use... 
one of the Kylie with collection. I have three of them. Where's the third? Oh, here. Yeah, I used this one. It's kind of like a little bit deeper than my skin tone. My lip tone. <laughs> my skin tone. Okay. I don't use any mascara. In the hang of things, I have been busy the last couple of days. So, I'm just getting back in the hang of my um, reviews now. Okay, I'm going to have to go underneath this here because it doesn't match. I'm going to take... Hmm, if I can find that Morphe palette. Blend it. Where did it go? I did buy a new Morphe palette. I can't wait to do it's been out for a while but i've been totally eyeing it for a while because it came out and i didn't know it came out because i took a high edges for makeup for a while this one i want to get into this one it's got great greens and then it's really cool yeah so can't wait to get into this one i've got quite a few to do we just face it, I got a lot to do. So I don't need to buy any more. Because <laughs> I have a lot to do. Okay. Okay, I'm going to go to number one, one shade here. Right here. This is the palette. Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry I didn't get the Jacqueline palette, but I really don't trust her sight, or her, sorry. Um, I, f I was totally bummed that she did not have it on the Morphe site, which is really weird, but it's Jacqueline. <laughs> I can say more, but I'm not, okay? It's Jacqueline. Things don't really make sense with Jacqueline sometimes. Okay. Wait. Okay. Cool. I think I'm totally need to edit this video. It's not going smoothly. Okay. Okay, I think I need to take something under both eyes. Hmm. I'm gonna take something to put underneath here. Okay, I'm gonna go into this palette. See, so can I find something? Okay. Okay. I think I'm gonna go to this light pink. <laughs> Very light, but not too light. Yeah, I don't trust Ulta either because I bought, bought two things for them. One in the, one of my shades didn't shatter shattered because the way it was packaged, it was like a joke. So, I don't trust the Ulta that there's a shipping around here. I don't. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. I do not trust them. So, but Morphe does terrific shipping. I just got the. I need to get more eyeliners. So just using a palette. I only have the like the Lucky Charm ones. And that's it. <laughs> and I don't have a like black or brown. So. Okay. Key. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay, and they want to go to a different palette. Okay, let's see what's in here. Let's see, can I use it? Uh, I do have this brown here. I was kind of wanting a dark brown. Uh, oh well. I guess I'm just going to go to a faded brown. Look. Buying um, ColourPop's ones. 
um like the whole packet because they have like i think it's for 80 dollars. they have to give you a whole lot of them i wish morphe has a huge in a huge set um i wish but they don't so okay i think i need a little highlight here kind of a brownish one it kind of matches my skin tone a little bit and i think that would look really pretty okay Oh, my pregnancy has been very easy so far. It seems like it's going to go very easy, just like it did last time. I only get, like, a little teensy bit more sickness. If I drink a soda and burp, um, it's cured. Yeah, I'm one of those weaker does. I just can't. I guess give birth naturally. So there's always something. <laughs> always. Okay. This is by Ofra too. So I got this from my mystery box with Ofra. They decided to put um cleansing wipes in it in hand sanitizer. I just wanted makeup, guys. <laughs> so I do like to collect her palettes. But that's a different subject in it. I just stick to this. So this is okay. The formula is okay. But it kind of beats the purpose. <laughs> um, to being a small palette. Because it's all shimmers. So it's a great palette to go with other palettes. Which doesn't make sense because of the size. Easy to pack. Um... I wish this was better. Um, I wish the color concept made more sense. This is my Nanak. Hmm. Hopefully I don't ruin my palette. This cost, what, $24? No, it is not my neck. It would make sense with these little mini palettes. You buy all of them and then mix and match them. Mix and, mix and match them. So it's okay formula. But it is pretty. But it doesn't go together. <laughs> Unless you're going to use all shimmers. And who uses all shimmers? I don't know. Maybe you do. I don't know. But I don't think it makes sense. Um, I love her as a singer. But I don't know. I just have a feeling that she didn't choose anything. She just put her name to it. But I don't know. I expect it more from her. She has very good style. And I really like the music. But anyway. Formula is okay. Um, it could be better. Like that whole idea was it being magnetic. And you switch them out. That would be cool. But I think this is about the same same price as this and this is a full palette um more reviews coming very soon i hope <laughs> it's been kind of hectic but anyway um thank you so much for watching me if you enjoyed it then if you have any pregnancy stories um that would be cool yeah put them in the comments be cool to open up conversation about that that'd be awesome Okay, if you like this look, thumbs up. If you like this look, thumbs down. So I know which one is better. <laughs> so this is, I'm going to close my eyes again. So 